now to a KCRA 3 exclusive tonight. For the first time, the victims of a horrendous car crash are speaking out. The crash happened at a car wash in Elk Grove last summer and injured six people. KCRA 3's David Beenick joins us now with a story you'll only see on KCRA. David. Yeah, Kelly, the workers at this car wash wanted to share their story and the dramatic surveillance video you're about to see. This crash has left them with scars, some you can see and some you can't, plus a lot of unanswered questions. It was a bright sunny day last July at Bubbles Car Wash in Elk Grove. Workers were busy making cars sparkle for the upcoming weekend. It was busy at first because it was a Friday. Garo Duranian, who's owned the car wash for the past seven years, was particularly proud of the team he'd put together. Eventually, the team gels and once it gels, it's a well-oiled machine and it moves well. Supervisor Myra Gonzalez was directing cars into three lanes of the car wash's detail area. Wow, I don't want to remember the day. Gabriel Franco was working on a white sedan in lane number one of the detail area. Security video shows Gabriel had just opened the back passenger side door to shine the inside of the window. I feel lucky because I'm still here. And Gregory Miller had just taken over the job of driving the cars from a coworker who'd gone to lunch. So I was the next best thing to go back there. Gregory had climbed into a 2012 Ford Expedition and started pulling it out of the wash tunnel. When I put it in gear, it just took off and came around a circle here. The time on the surveillance video shows it was exactly 11:32 a.m. and shows what happened next. I hear uh, like explosion, uh, the towels flying, and every tina flying. Us. And you know what? That SUV kept going. Coming up tonight on the KCRI 3 News at 10 o'clock on My58, we'll show you what happened next, how the co-workers sprang into action to help one another, and how far they've come since the recovery, and what the investigators found when they went looking for a cause.